I've always had a, an interest in what education might look like in the coming years and at GCC we had an opportunity to explore this firsthand with our Year 10 cohort. In 2000, 2016 we launched a, a program called the DeLorean Project and our, our exploration was around the general capabilities that we see in the national curriculum. Uh, we had an opportunity to make these the focus of our teaching and learning and so uh, the DeLorean project is a student negotiated program where we focus on the general capabilities, uh, some would call them the 21st century skills, entrepreneurial skills. Uh, we teach those explicitly, we give students an opportunity to explore and, and test out their skill, those skills in low risk activities to start with and then we encourage them to follow their passions and interests uh, and explore learning that, um, that pushes them beyond maybe their, their traditional academic boundaries uh, where they're engaging with the community, uh, they're exploring something that they're really interested in and they're really driving their own learning for the year. We feel that this sort of program is important because when you look at the research around the future of jobs and employment in Australia and around the world, uh, what seems to be uh, apparent is that students need the, the, the skills uh, such as communication, collaboration, working as a team, uh, design and creativity, and it's those skills that are going to make them most successful, not so much content knowledge, which our traditional system currently teaches. We wanted to give students the opportunity to, to really develop those skills and we think those are the skills that are going to set them up for success regardless of what career paths they choose in the future. Uh, we, we feel this program is innovative because it, it really flips teaching and learning on its head. Uh, the staff involved are very much facilitators and really don't have most of the answers to most of the questions that are being asked and students are really taking control of their learning and, and driving uh, their education in this context. Uh, we use technology in, in really specific ways that leverage the projects uh, and we, um, we try to provide frameworks that uh, allow students to um, study their passions but do it within the context of the general capabilities and the skills that we're trying to develop. So we provide uh, a framework called the DeLorean Spheres which um, students need to use to negotiate their projects and those spheres, uh, there's three spheres, one is uh, solving a problem, the second is using an entrepreneurial mindset to solve that problem and the third is the use of technologies to leverage their learning. DeLorean projects can take a number of forms and really that's based on uh, the passion and interest of students as well as uh, their ability to meet the three DeLorean spheres. Uh, so often they start with finding the problem they want to solve that exists within their passion or interest area and then using an entrepreneurial mindset which is really the, the skills that are outlined by the general capabilities uh, to solve that problem and of course um, the technology sphere which is really about using technology to, to solve the problem more effectively or efficiently. Uh, so we, we see DeLorean projects in the context of commercial and business uh, needs, uh, we see social justice projects, uh, we see students involved in more of a social media context. Um, it really is based on the passion of, of the students. The collaborative teaching uh, part of the DeLorean project is probably the most significant um, for me personally and I think for the teachers involved. Um, we have seven staff that on a weekly basis have to get together and work really closely as a team to deliver the, um, the DeLorean curriculum. Uh, that's not something that I don't think any of us have been used to in our teaching careers um, and it's really pushing us uh, and, and pushing us out of our comfort zone as teachers, um, working so closely with each other, teaching in front of each other on a regular basis. Uh, but we've really had to adapt and learn how to work with each other and um, and I guess when someone has a strength, we, we leverage that and when we know we have weaknesses, we're honest about it and we look for others on the team to, to cover those. Um, so I guess in a sense what we're doing as, as a DeLorean team is, is no different to what we're asking our students to do on a regular basis. And so I guess there's a bit of modelling there too that's really beneficial for our, for our students.
I think student learning has changed significantly in the DeLorean project. I, I, I wouldn't say technology is the main reason for that. I think it's the pedagogy that's really changed student learning. Uh, I think flipping the pedagogy on its head where students become the, the, uh, the driver of their learning, where they're taking ownership and taking initiative and negotiating their learning with teachers, and teachers really become facilitators and guides uh, and, not, and not the traditional font of all knowledge is what really changes student learning. I think. Um, also, we're asking students to uh, explore learning projects that follow their passions and interests, and as soon as you do that, uh, and hopefully also make some real-world connections, you get a, a higher engagement uh, of students, you get a deeper learning happening on many levels, uh, you get students more willing to spend time exploring their projects, um, and I think overall you just you make learning really meaningful, something that students actually will walk away from and, um, and remember for a long time. And hopefully, uh, at least our vision is that what they do in DeLorean changes their trajectory as far as the careers they choose to pursue and their success in those careers. I think the technology really helps. Uh, without the technology, I don't think we could do what we do. Um, I think the, the ability we have to communicate with each other uh, using the, the, the technology that we have, um, access to information, um, the use of social media uh, when it comes to uh, making contacts, particularly in our community and networking, um, which is something that's really significant in the DeLorean project. We couldn't do that without the technology. Um, and then the collaborative tools we use in Google, Cla uh, Google Classroom, um, Google Drive, Google Docs, uh, where teams are able to easily collaborate on projects in real time, um, that, that definitely leverages the learning, but the pedagogy is definitely the thing that changes it the most.